Check. Good boy. Dino just came home from yeah. San Diego to El Paso. The Diaz family says their newly adopted dog fits right in. And we just met him yesterday. Yes. And um, I like mean, we've known him. We've known him. The six and a half year old canine trained with one of the Diaz family's three sons, Christopher. Guess what I'm going to do? And I said, what's that son? He says, uh, I need to write an essay on why I would want to become a canine handler. Marine Staff Sergeant Christopher Diaz and his dog fought the Taliban in Afghanistan. They were often gone for weeks at a time. That's Christopher. Chris was with, uh, with MARSOC, a special Marine Corps team that the Marine Corps has. It's something similar to uh, the Rangers or the SEALs. Eight, eight, nine, nine, six, five, seven, three. How copy? In September of 2011, Staff Sergeant Diaz didn't make it back. One day, his mom answered a knock at the door. Her son had been killed in action. It wasn't something we expected, but on the other side of that door were those Marines that I called their, the angels. They came to us to let us know he was gone, but he was, it was gonna be okay. The family asked for permission to adopt their son's dog, and the Navy granted their wish. This is what our son was, was with for three years. You know, our son cared for him. Now, after years in battle, followed by a three-year wait to get adopted and a retirement ceremony at Camp Pendleton. And they were inseparable. Dino came home. There's a little bit of Chris in here. Alex Shrek. It's okay to cry every day if you have to. ABC 7.